Survivor Series by Daniel Warren Johnson is by now the it's the most fun we're having, right, guys? I mean, it literally. Tell me what else you're reading that is more fun than this. It's such a blast. The, the last issue ended with Optimus Prime picking up and using the arm cannon from Megatron, and here's how this this is the standard cover with him looking at a reflection of himself. And the story is so heavy and deep. And we're not gonna get through all this stuff. I don't want to spoil anything because um, DWJ is so passionate about all this. This stuff is so good. And you have the where we kind of left off with the tragedy last time. And you have this sort of like, this is basically them telling each other their stories of what, what they both have gone through. And we know that when we get to this page where you have Sparky in the front and Optimus looking out the window in the back. And then they kind of have this exchange about, you know, war stories and what you've seen, the horror war and different things that you've gone through. And then there's this great, great line right here with Sparky. You've seen so much more than me. You're from a different galaxy. Maybe you know why it has to be like this. <clears throat> and if only the light years I've traveled equaled the wisdom I've gained, but it's not so. I ask myself that question every day, Sparky, but then I see my reflection and I see the very thing I'm fighting against. Wow, so good stuff. Such good stuff. You've seen so much more than me. You're from a different galaxy. Maybe you know why it has to be like this. He's like, if only the light years I've traveled equal to wisdom I've gained, but it's not so. I ask myself that question every day, Sparky, and then I see my reflection, and I see the very thing I'm fighting against. So, so good. So after we have that moment, DWJ makes no time just to have chaos break out. Chaos breaks out. We cut away to the Decepticons who are trying to rebuild. It's just complete insanity. Them trying to bicker with one another. They're ready to go on the attack. Starscream's leading them away. And then we cut to uh, where Sparky's working with them. You ha have them working on this new turbine. This, this so it's a it's a hydroelectric plant, and he, uh, Sparky is helping them engineer this turbine to make it work and that'll give them the energy that they need. And it's all this really interesting back and forth. And actually it, it's fun how this would seem very trivial or boring or nonsensical in most comics, but it is not at all in this. It's just, I don't know. The pages just turn themselves. It's so good. Anyway. So when you get to the first big moment where they get the machine running and Optimus brings forth rc so rc she uh she's the female autobot um comes forth she's brought back and immediately she's thrust into harm's way she saves ratchet uh from the attack by the uh, decepticons so the amount of action the cameos the all the elements that you want out of out of a comic book series comes into play it's just it's all done so well it's done great for page turning the art is fine. Um, it's not always super detailed. It is always reflecting movement and action. And you feel like you're there in this adventure. So it gives the people that are fans of the cartoon, the animated movie, and things like that exactly what they want. And then you basically have just throwdown. A massive throwdown. Just total chaos and violence and battles. And anytime you think it's going to go a certain way, there's another twist. There's another turn that kind of takes it in a different direction. Um, yeah, I, I don't know what to say. I just can't tell you enough about how much it just makes me want to read the next comic, buy another comic, turn the page, read it again. I've read it twice already. Um, I can't wait to go and pick up like some of the variant covers and get some of the different things. I just I'm, like this is exactly what made me want to read and enjoy comics. Why I maybe mean, wanted to collect and get them and stuff like that. And Transformers is hitting on all cylinders. So I know there's a lot of changes coming in the next few months, but. I'm still on board until otherwise. Um, let me hear from you guys. Tell me what you guys think. What are you guys thinking? What do you got? Um, I've actually been able to add some of this to my eBay store over the next few weeks because I'll be able to get an order back. So hopefully I'll get those posted here soon. We can get those out to folks who didn't have a copy. I got one person. Well, I got two people now who are going to get copies from me. So yeah, it's, it's in demand because people want to have good stuff to read. So uh, thanks for watching, everybody. I am Pops.